What's up? What's up? What's up? Another day at Zadar. So, there's our favorite Korean boy, Mr. Brian. And then, oh, that's Lee. So, Lee's our, uh, he's our new detailer, one of our detailers. And there's my boy Eric with the E63S. Ni hao. Ni boy. What up, bro? This Eric's new whip. There's Lee. Struggling to park. What's up? What's up, boy? What's up? Ni hao, this is Lee. He's this like, he's like at her age. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the new whip whips. Let me see that shit. Are you happy? Oh, Are you excited? <laughs> I think I think I think Russ's car is bigger because yeah, the rear, is longer. the back is bigger. Yeah, but I like how this looks smaller. Damn yeah, boy! It's probably our uh, customer service manager. That's providing some excellent fucking customer relations. And this is our uh, I don't, he. I don't know. He's manager. And this is our manager of, uh, this is our food manager. I manage Brian. the he, Yeah, he manages the managers. So, uh, can I speak to your manager, please? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> so today we're gonna go scout out some roads in Snoqualmie. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it. Damn it. Can I take it? <laughs> well, you ain't taking nothing because me and him gotta go, so. Take, uh, the CLA. I don't want the CLA. Look at, look at. That's what ballers wear. Yeah. Huh? It's just Mercedes standard. Beep. Beep, beep, yeah. beep, 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 beep. Damn it! So, I really like this black. I want to paint my car this color, but everyone's telling me not to. Also, I'm broke. So, he got the buttons. He wants to get a new steering wheel, but he also just bought an M3 CS, so. Pop pops. Hella dope. Oh, oh, the one thing with the with the CS. Ah, soft close. Soft close, boy. Soft close, no more broke boy spec. If you come hang out here, don't drive the CS no more. <laughs> oh, ah, damn, you broke boy too. Damn. No, I feel like anything that doesn't have soft close anymore is broke boy spec. So all our cars inside is broke boy spec too. <laughs> Damn, look at this Hollister model out here, boy. Damn. So, taking the R8 and the 650S. Ooh. So this is gonna be in, the, oh well. Camera's gonna be really shaky right now because I'm kind of barely holding on to it. But have my camera stuck. And if y'all ever wondered how big the front of the McLaren was, uh, So like I said, carry on, reference. So you can actually fit a decent amount of stuff in here. It's not too bad. So this is a 650S Spider. Um, and we're gonna be at RTC this weekend. So if you guys are going to RTC, uh, come with us. Um, if you're going to rent a car, let me know. Pick up on this one. Ready to go? 
page. He just went to the bathroom. <laughs> oh, brown boy. So I guess, let me get kind of cold start of the McLaren. Dima's Audi. Um, I think, did Vlad just do paint correction on it? Yeah. Look at our spark lay. He didn't clean the windows. What the hell? Did you did you come back last night or not? Nah? Whoops. GTR with a lift up. Oops. I think I did that. Pop up. McLaren. Brian. Bad Jin, aka Bad Jin, and then we have Eric in the R8.
we've arrived in Snoqualmie and Snoqualmie is about like I would say like 20 minutes east of uh, of uh, Bellevue where we are and so there's the golf course here um, Snoqualmie Falls and Salish Lodge is right next to the Snoqualmie Falls and so that's where we're going um, yeah so I'll show you guys a waterfall I mean if you guys come to Washington State that's one of the places to go because that's pretty dope so Chris, he's the supervisor um, of valet, right, at, yep. at, at Salish Lodge, which I've never been to, even though I've always been to Snoqualmie Falls. So if you need to valet your car, this is the guy, you can trust him. He takes care of all of our babies. And this is a, this is a dope spot. How did you find these roads? Uh, I've lived out here my whole life, but yeah, trial and error, you find the right ones, and this is definitely the right one. Small oh, hike, yeah. down to a waterfall. Oh, you, oh, you can, oh, is that the walking road right there? Oh, uh, you go up here. Okay, well, I guess now we're gonna get. Okay, 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 Eric. <laughs> now I can't U turn. <laughs> Dope whip. So we're back at the dart. So we've got Trumpy all day here. There's Gray. Is it raining? Titi to RS. Hi, Gray. How's it going? This is Gray. I don't think you guys have met Gray, but this is Gray. Why is it so dirty? Why is it holy shit? I don't know, I guess he decided to rally it. Whipped over to Dirtfish real quick? Yeah. No, we were just I, by I there. I actually have no idea. As far as I know, he's just... Dude, what? What? Isn't the whole car PPF? Nope. It's nothing PPF. What? <laughs> what you up to today? Well, you're on the blog, so... So Gray also has that IPE. IPE 2. No, fuck 3RS. 0.2 3RS. It's not an RS, motherfucker. Fuck! 0.2 GD3. Fuck! <laughs> Where's our what? Birds aren't real. Birds aren't real. It's true. He's. This is Leo when he drives his convertible. He's like that dad. He looks like it's a dad. Khaki yeah, mate. fuck. I did dad spec. Yeah, and he's got yeah, the Omega. Daddy, don't leave me. Whenever my laundry. I don't do my laundry. I have dad spec. Daddy, don't leave me. Come back. 
Oh, Have dude. the carbon fiber belt like Jackson. Yeah. Make him some stiff ass carbon pants. <laughs> <laughs> I right, take more photos and then yeah. So if you guys didn't know what a GT2 RS is, it's the dopest of the GT series. Turbo. And it's RS. So they didn't make just a regular GT2 this generation. Um, this one has my size package, so it has the wheels. 918 seats. Oh yeah. Yellow stitching with Alcantara. Carbon backs. Carbon, carbon, and the carbon fender lures, and then the carbon hood. Yeah, we're all remote thinking. Yeah, I mean, I'm taking the star. So. Oh, so yeah, he's coming. Gray is coming too. It's so RTCD. So we'll see you guys. RTC. Um, we're dipping. Bye. So Gray was the saying these knack ducks go into these these vents and then that goes into the brake net. And look at that dry carbon. That's real carbon. That's a real carbon hood. Yeah. Not not some bullshit like mine and Brian's. <laughs> we have CRFP. That's actually carbon fiber. With the sticker, lightweight, bro. Yeah. How much did you say the hood cost again? Forty thousand dollars. Dope. That's a major drone beat. Huh? Major flex. It's like, want to make a down payment on a house, or you want to buy a GT3 RS hood for your car? It's like decision, decision. You, <laughs> it's a GT3, right? Everything about this car is the same. There are carbon body panels, different engine. It's like this might as well be a 3RS, so you're you're paying for an engine. No, it's more like, do you want to buy a hood or do you want to buy Eric's car? <laughs> <laughs> Eric's getting roasted, you don't even know. <laughs> no, the wing is different. Um, the, I, the uprights are also a little different. But there's, yeah, it's adjustable, so it's, it's nice. Put this shit up in the air brake mode so it's not so fast. <laughs> Honestly, this thing's a parachute. I mean, yeah. There's a there's a guy in LA who has a wing office and it looks so I fucking cool. I thought I was gonna hate it and I was like, I want to hate this, but I can't. Yeah. It's beautiful. It, I, it just makes it into such. A okay. Yeah. Like I said, Saturday RTC. We'll see you guys. Wow. That's the end of this vlog today. Bye.